Hey, what's going on guys? This is Game Note 321 and right now it looks like it's that's an hour ahead. It looks like it's 1:30 in the morning. Let me check my phone actually. Yeah, it's 1:33 in the morning. 1:31 in the morning. This is an hour ahead. I got to fix that. But I noticed how I haven't uploaded a video in like a week, so I just feel like doing this random thing. Uh, it's just a let's play of Resident Evil Code Veronica X, and I'm just going to do a live com over it, so it's going to be a channel update, just going to say some random stuff. I don't normally do these let's play type of videos, but I'm just going to play for like 20 minutes and stuff. The reason why it's Code Veronica X, Resident Evil, is just because they had an Xbox deal, and I just saw that, oh, it's $6? I have This is like one of the Resident Evil games I haven't beat. Like, I've played a ton of Resident Evil games, like the classic ones, like Resident Evil 1, 2, uh, 0, Resident Evil 4, and stuff like that. So yeah, I just got right here. I'm going to play it. Um, I've had this game on PS2, and I got like maybe not even halfway through, like I'm probably 20% done with the game. So I just now got it. I'm going to talk about random stuff. And yeah, that's all I'm gonna really say. So you don't have to watch this video. It's just something I feel like doing at two in the morning, one in the morning. I don't even know. So yeah, let's go ahead and start a new game. Resident Evil. Resident Evil. That sounds gay. This part. Oh, look at this part. This is like the most badass thing you can ever see in this game. Look at this. Oh my God, she's dropping the gun. What is she gonna do? Surrender? What is she gonna do? Oh my God. Phase trick shot. Mom, get the camera. Get the Surprise, motherfucker! Don't move. Oh my god, what happened? We're on the floor. Where are we? I don't really remember this cutscene, guys. Like, I had this game on PS2, I just haven't played this game in, like, a couple years. What's going on? Everything's shaking. Oh, the light bulb went out. What happened? All I know is that a black guy came out of nowhere and pointed a gun at me. No racial, though. I'm in jail? What happened? I got arrested. That's messed up. I can't remember even why I got arrested. I know I know. in the cutscene, you're Claire and you go into the a secret facility to find your brother and then they cap you. And then you go into this prison thing. And then you wake up. And you see this guy come out of nowhere. Oh yeah, I remember. He's hurt. Yeah, that's what happened. Look at them lips. The red shoes. At least they're not clown shoes like in Kingdom Hearts. He's breathing. He's breathing. What up? Everything's so dark. If I were equipped with the lighter, I could see outside. <laughs> Subtitles. <laughs> you see that you see that random black guy just like on the other side staring at me? He's like, What you doing, girl? You've been in a lot of trouble, young lady. But we got a surprise for you. Lighter. Oh, equip. Oh, I'm equipping the lighter. It's on. Hey, there he is. Surprise mother I don't trust you. Wow, look at these next-gen PS2 graphics. Oh my god, they're so amazing. Perfect. No more pills? <laughs> Don't be Go Lewis. On. Get out of here. This place is finished. I this place know, is finished. It might have been a special forces team. But in Who any knows? case, this prison's been taken over. Troops have been wiped. What are you saying? You're free to leave the complex. Oh, I'm free? That's awesome. You may as well know you have no chance of getting off this island. And what about you? What are you going to do? Don't worry about me. Okay, so the guy just said, don't worry about me. Or don't worry about him. So, yeah. Uh, like I said, I've already played this. Wow, look at this. This is so bad. Do you hear the footsteps? I'm not even moving my legs. Oh, this is so bad. Like I said, this is a PS2 game just on the 360. It looks way better. I remember on PS2 it looked like crap, but this is just how the game is. Let me talk to you. Come on, say something. His eyes are closed. He's bleeding. I'll need to hemostatic hem 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 medicine. His eyes, he's bleeding. Oh, he's just saying the same thing. Yeah, I love, I love Resident Evil games. Like, I just find them 
cool, mysterious, and creepy, and it's like survival horror. Like, you know, you get to this next part, you gotta know what happens, and then these monsters get scarier and scarier as you go. Handgun bullets, that's awesome. Okay, I need like a gun or something. Pills. The capsule is on the floor. It's empty. I remember when I played this part, you have to go out there, find some medicine. You find medicine, you can bring it back to him, and then, you know, he'll probably give you something. A combat knife, I'll take that. Yeah, this this game, I, I love it. Like, I play Resident Evil 4, and I love that one, but it's not scary. It's not classic Resident Evil like these. Like, these camera angles be, like, scary and stuff. Like, you can't control the camera angles. Oh, typewriters, I remember these things. Yeah, you gotta get these, uh, you gotta get these ink ribbons. Yeah, that's how you t that's how you freaking save data. You type like a bunch of stuff, and then that's how you do it. Playing as Claire, awesome. Okay, so now we get back to what I was going to talk about. Um, yeah, I already told you guys I love Resident Evil games. Uh, I would have done a let's play of a game called Kingdom Hearts 2. Uh, new game came out, uh, Kingdom Hearts 2.5 HD came out for PS3, but sadly I don't have my PS3 with me. Uh, it's somewhere else. So yeah, I'm just gonna play be Resident Evil. You hear that heartbeat and those footsteps? This is scary. What's out here? What is the sound? This is so creepy. What is this? It's sparking. A truck used for transportation. Oil is leaking from the crashed wreck. What's gonna happen? I don't know what's gonna happen. Oh, whatever. Oh shit, it exploded. What the hell? Oh. Oh damn, it's a zombie. I gotta get that briefcase. Oh man, this is a zombie. Oh no, it looks disgusting. I feel bad how I'm playing this game two days before Christmas. Like, we shouldn't be playing this. Don't fall. You're not supposed to do that. You've seen zombies before. Claire, get up. I know you're gonna get up. You gotta get up and run. No! Oh, they're coming alive. <laughs> dead zombies. I don't even know if zombies can be dead. Come on, get up. Stop, stop, stop crying. It's not that bad. They're just gonna eat your face off. You'll be fine. <laughs> Ooh, they're naked. <laughs> Whoa. They bury them naked? I thought they buried them with clothes. Wonderful. Wow, these zombies look really creepy. I don't like them. I like shooting them, though. That's awesome. They're all over me, dude. How am I supposed to escape from here? What am I supposed to do? Get off of me. No. No one wants you. Don't touch me. Hi. Come on, open. Yeah, you gotta push X. <laughs> I keep pushing A. You hold A to sprint, which is bad. Achievement unlocked. The terror begins. Oh, I got an achievement for playing the game. Awesome. Whoa. Who's this guy? He's shooting me! Don't shoot me! That's a sad excuse for a machine gun sound. Do you hear that? <laughs> Do you hear that? It sounds like a sewing machine. Oh, it's that guy! I remember him. Yeah, shoot that light out. See, Claire's a badass. Wait, wait. Don't shoot. Oh, this guy! He has the worst voice acting ever. You're not a zombie. Listen. Well, great. We're right there. He sounds like a 12-year-old. He sounds like a 12-year-old, I remember. He has the worst voice acting. Listen. Uh, sorry about that little misunderstanding. But I thought you were another one of those monsters. Shut up. Make one wrong move and I'll shoot. Yeah. Listen, bitch. Relax, beautiful. I said I was sorry. My name's Steven. He said sorry. Yeah, his name I is Steven. A on this island. Edie? You'll only slow me down. You only slow me down. That's what he said. That's what he sounds like. He sounds like a 12-year-old. You only slow me down. Oh, you think you're better than me? A handgun. Awesome. I have handgun bullets. Now how do I shoot? Oh, you hold the right trigger? And then you push A, I guess. X. Yeah, you push X to shoot while you're holding right trigger. I thought it would be like Call of Duty where you have the left trigger. You hold that stuff to aim and use the right trigger to shoot. That'd be cool. I wish I could change the controls like that, but I don't feel like looking. Because I'm doing the Let's Play. This, is, this isn't this is really a Let's Play. Like, I'm not going to be doing no 1 Part 1, Part 2, Part 3, Part 4, Part 5. Because I feel like it just gets boring after the first part. So I'm only going to do like the first 20 minutes, like I said in the beginning. So I don't even know where to go. Uh, I already came from there. There's Zambies. Oh, you know what? There's a briefcase that way. But I think I need a better gun or something. That briefcase has something. I gotta go check it out, though. Let's see Let's see what it is, actually. <laughs> He's walking towards me, but the other one's trying to walk away. This is terrible. Die. 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 These are weak zombies, dude. Shit. 
That would make sense if I was playing on Halloween. If I was playing this game on Halloween, but I really don't give a crap. Oh, that's the map. How do I open up my inventory? Do I have to pause? Oh, that's what I do. Yeah, it's very important to save ammo in this game. Like, if they fall on the floor, you want to use your knife and, like, cut the ground to make sure they don't bite your feet. Because they be doing that. And you can also check if they're bleeding. Because if they're bleeding, then, then that means they're dead. Oh, wait. The briefcase fell. Oh, damn. Wow, I remember this. I have to extinguish the freaking uh, fire so I can get the briefcase. I came down here for nothing. Okay, that's awesome. So I don't even know where else to go. I guess I'll just explore. But one of the things I had to say was, uh, I know my most recent video before this one was actually a channel update for the uh, my Brody Elite's clan in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Uh, congratulations, guys. We actually did win the clan wars. We actually won by one capture. Uh, I woke up at like, 2 or like 1.30 p.m. and the clan was about to end in 30 minutes and the other clan was about to win and like they were winning by one clan point and I was like what are we doing we can't let them win we've tried so hard so I got on and we actually like captured uh, one of the points and we actually beat them and they were actually about to capture another point and get more points but they ran out of time and the clan was ended so yeah we got first place in the second clan which was totally awesome but there is a side effect to that um, for the next Clan Wars, uh, we're going to need better people because we're going in Diamond Division, possibly. And with Diamond Division, are the really good players. I'm kicking a lot of people that didn't even help for the Clan Wars. So those of you who were in the Clan and you didn't even help at all, you have like 5 wins or 5 points or 10 points, or you're just not even active, I kicked you. So I'm really sorry about that, guys, if you're not even on the Clan anymore. Can I go out here? I think I've already came from out here. I don't even know. Let's just check. Oh yeah, I remember this part. Dogs come out and grab you, which is really bad. Like, it's creepy. I'm trying to see if I can find where else else to go. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go out there where the dogs are at. Okay. I really don't like those dogs, but see, you can easily, you can easily outrun the dogs. Like, they're not that hard to run away from. But we should go out this door right here. But yeah, guys, we did win the second clan war. We're in Platinum Division, so that's absolutely great, which is good. So really, thank you guys a lot. I don't know exactly what the Wii award is, but they hand out the awards three days after the Clan Wars. It's locked. I need to get something. Now, I don't know when the dogs come out. Like, this it, it, this game jump scares you quite a bit. Like, it's creepy. Let's see what's in here, actually. Oh, there's a green herb over here. I gotta pick this up. Let's see what it is. Oh, I know what's in this building. They're zombies. Like, oh my god, it gets so freaking creepy. I gotta go in here and get this gun, though, because there's a really cool gun in here. Like, it's a dual-wield pistol gun. Like, it uses, uh, 9mm handgun rounds, but... Oh, shit! No! It's so close to me! What the fuck? Oh, shiz! No! I didn't know they'd be that close to me. Come on. Die. I know you're over there. Come on. That zombie got so close to me. What the hell, dude? Okay, he's on the floor. Now I gotta pick up my knife and start cutting him. Die. 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 Get off of me! You're supposed to die after the freaking third one. That's how I remember this. Unless the guy unless these zombies have more freaking health. Die. 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 Come on. You know you want to die. Die. You're supposed to fall. There you go. Now let me get out my knife to make sure he's dead. I wish I really wish in these Resident Evil games they would have like a quick switch button so you can switch between two weapons, and there's a zombie right there. Let's see if I can cut him through here. Don't even know if I can. No. No. I can't do it. He's so slow. Like, he's so stubby and short. Okay, let's get out this thing. I see some more handgun bullets over there, so... Screw you. Are you dead? Yeah, he's dead. He's bleeding. Toilet. I love toilet water. This is awesome. There's cockroaches. The smell lingers. What am I supposed to do in this room? There's nothing in here. Now, I don't know what's in this room exactly. If I do remember, it's gonna be like a creepy room with a bunch of dead bodies everywhere, and it's gonna be like... Oh, yeah. What's that banging? I can't remember what it's in there. I hear I hear the sounds. I hear the banging. See, I know some zombies are gonna come out. I just forgot where, because I like I said, I haven't played this game in a while. Like I played it on the PS2 and I got like 20% done with the game. And I got stuck somewhere, and I don't know where. Bullets! Now if I grab those bullets, I think zombies are supposed to come out, but I'm scared. <laughs> I've always been creeped out in zombie games because they make these weird they make the at they make the atmosphere of the game so creepy that you don't even know what's gonna happen. Like you hear things and then anything can jump out at you at the same time. Oh, he's out there. You see him? He's banging on the window. How did you find me? Ugly. 
I think if I pick up this ammo, he's gonna come out after me. I hope he doesn't. Yes, take the handgun bullets. Uh, you gotta be joking. I knew he would come out. I remember that. Oh, he has those guns. That was the guns I was talking about. Die. Die. Okay, gotta get out my knife. Save ammo. I'll cut him while he's on the floor. Die. Is he dead? Die! There he is. He's dead. <gasps> what? There's more behind me! Get the fuck away from me! Die! 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 No! Don't bite my feet! Get off of me! Get off of me! Don't bite my feet! Go eat some other girl! Not that, not like that though. Stop biting my feet! You guys are ugly! Die! I'm hurt. Yeah, I'm in the caution. Damn it. Hey, the music stopped. That means they're gone. Alright, good. That's what I mean. Like, I knew the zombies would come after me, but I didn't know when. I think it was when I would grab the bullets. Fuff. They hurt me. Okay. I'm just in the caution, though. But I have herbs, so I'm fine. I got this. Now, he dropped those guns. These are the guns I'm talking about right here. Hold on. Take the M100Ps. Yeah. These are the guns that can actually take handgun rounds, and they're, like, dual wheel and stuff. Like, it's awesome. I think they can take handgun rounds, because it says 100%, but I'm pretty sure you can load them with handgun bullets. Yeah. Yeah, see? You can just shoot them like that. It's cool. Dual wielding. Awesome. Now I have better guns. What's in here? More bullets. Awesome. There's blood and guts everywhere. I didn't know bullets can bleed. Now, all I know is the zombies are going to be coming out. I think the zombie dogs come out, actually. Bruh! I don't want you. Yeah, you're just going to be an ammo waster. I don't need you. I think I came in here for everything that I needed, so... Everything's fine. Now, the zombie busted in through this window. Yeah, it's, I think it's cracked open. Now, as I recall, zombie dogs. Yeah, this is the cutscene. Oh, it's first person view. Zombie dogs. Nah, bitch, I'm coming back up here. Are you gonna come out? Yeah, they don't come out until you, like, walk down more. You know what? Let's just go. F it. Let's go. Jump scare me. Jump scare me. Come on, brah. Come on, brah. Come on, brah. I know you're here. I know you're here. Ew. Oh, damn. That's the zombie dogs eating the zombie. Zombie dogs eat zombies? <laughs> I didn't know that. <laughs> zombie dogs eat zombies. I know they're gonna come out. Right here. Is it here? Or is it the next the next corner? Oh yeah. You go through this door and when you come back out, the zombie dogs come for you. Can I can I open the lock from this side? No. I can't, damn it. So I have to go all the way around. Yep. Yeah, I remember when you come back the zombie dogs come out. See they did that same thing in Resident Evil 1 when you go through this one part. Oh hey, there's a zombie. How you doing, bro? Oh, there's more. Let's shoot him with dual wheels. Die. There we go. Oh. Don't bite my feet. Yeah, he's bleeding. He's dead. Wait, I shouldn't waste these. I shouldn't wait. I shouldn't waste these guns on that that major stutter though. Oh my god. Yeah, I shouldn't waste. Those. <gasps> what the fuck? He walked faster. You douchebag. I'm knifing you. Save my bullets. Die. Die. See, there we go. See, he died in the first two slashes. See, that first zombie I cut like three times did not want to die. Oh, I remember this part. This part is stupid. You see this? It's a metal detector, and you can't go through holding weapons or a knife. So I have to, like... Please deposit any metallic items you have see, look at this. Please box. deposit metallic items. See, I can't really go... I can't go farther, because, see, look. It blocks the doors. And I can't go anywhere, because I have metallic items. See? I can't go anywhere. I think there's zombies over here, actually. No, there isn't. Yeah, see? I can't go, because I have metal on me. Like, I have a knife... I have a gun. It won't let me go. Now I have to give this gun away, my pistol away, my ammo away. Now I can go through. See, I have nothing. How am I going to defend myself? And there's zombies out there. You see them out the window? Look at this. They're all out there. I have no weapons. No means of defending myself. Oh, what's this? Is this another empty box? Yeah, it's an empty one. Man, I thought my items would transfer. That'd be cool. Okay. I remember this room. Oh, wait. This is grenade launcher rounds. I hear people typing on the computer. What is this? Oh, it's that guy. Chris Redfield. Chris Redfield. What are you, what are doing, you doing here? here? Oh. <laughs> Chris Redfield. Is he a relative of yours or something? You mean my brother? Ah, there's no way he could get here, even if he is your brother. Yes, he can. I'm sure of it. No way. He won't come. You'll just end up disappointed if you rely on others. Believe me, I know. See, he sounds like a twelve-year-old. You'll just believe. What you'll just was something. That all about? 
what was that all about? Yeah, I'm telling you, like, the voice acting in this game is so bad. Like, it's just ugly. And I don't even know if I'm going to end the game right here because I could keep going, but I don't know how long you guys are willing to, you know, watch this. I know Let's Plays aren't all that. Unless, like, you're Markiplier or PewDiePie because when they do Let's Plays, they get, like, a lot of requests to keep doing more, but the Let's Plays just keep dropping after that. I, I really don't know about continuing this. This is just a random thing I felt like doing out of nowhere because I haven't uploaded a video in a while, and that's pretty much it. What did I come here for then? To save my game? There's nothing really here. Oh, this is what I meant. This is what I needed. The Hawk Emblem. Okay. I hear zombies. What? I hear footsteps. Are they are they inside here, or are they like outside like last time? Okay. I call it a 3D Please printer. Deposit I don't care. Any metallic items really? I forgot. The it's detecting the little medallion, the freaking pendant, or the emblem that I have. All I know is that that switch unlocked the freaking doors to those zombies. There's something back there. I'm gonna have to equip my gun. Right here. There we go. This pistol should do the work. Yep, that's the button to actually open the door. Okay. This over opens. I think zombies coming out. I remember Zambi. Oh shit, they come out of that door too? That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. I'm gonna have to get out my good guns. Okay. This one should do fine. Yeah, th yeah, this is fine. I'm in a corner, just two guns, four zombies. I can take them. It's not that bad. So I get closer. I spray these guys. It's not that bad. Okay. They're on the floor. And the music stopped. Okay, that's good. Okay. <gasps> fire hydrant! I need this to turn the freaking uh, fire off. I need this. Okay. <laughs> Look at this logic. A whole fire hydrant can fit in me, but... Um, like, I understand the fire hydrant takes up a slot, but why a knife? A whole knife? Like, seriously? <laughs> That's the only thing I hate about the old ones, is that the inventories. And you see this guillotine? Ew, it's ugly. Why do they need a guillotine here? Oh, what? You can't take any more items. Oh, this is a key. That must be a key to unlock, like, a drawer or something. Oh, the padlock key! That's the key that you use to go with the other side. I remember. Yeah, this part is where the dog should be jumping out and jump scaring me. Come out. Can I unlock it from this side? Yeah, the padlock's on the other side. I have to go around. This is where the dogs come out. I know. I hear the eerie music. I hear the freaking the ambient sounds. Here they come. They're going to jump scare me. I'm already ready for it. Come out. Come out. I know you're here. Come out. Doggies. Doggies. There it is. See, there it is. Oh my god. He's right there. You can outrun them. They're really slow. Like, I'm not scared because, I, like I said, I've played this before. See, they can't even get up here. They're stupid. Even if they can... Yeah, they can't even get up here. They're retarded. See, look. They're retarded. They gotta go away. Yeah, I think they're gone. Possibly. Who knows? Yeah, there's one around the corner, I think. I hear his feet steps. See? Use the padlock. Yeah, use the key. There we go. That frees up a space. Don't eat me. See? <laughs> they're, they're really slow. They're really slow. You can outrun them easily. Yum. You hear that? That's the sound it makes when a zombie eats another person. You hear that? He's right there. Like, it looks like he's just, like, having sex with the dude, which is bad. Don't watch, kids. Whoa! Oh my god, that jump scare. I did not see- That wasn't even a jump scare, dude. Like, I just didn't expect him to be there. These zombies are so quiet. Like, look at them. Now, I have the fire extinguisher, and I have to go burn out that fire, but these zombies are in the way. I'm not even gonna shoot them, because that's just an ammo waster. I'm just gonna juke them out. They're really slow. That's what I could do. I just killed you! Okay, let's juke him out. Bitch! Ooh, weave game! Bitch! Ooh, weave game! Bitch! Ah, oh, damn it. Get off me. Okay, awesome. Now that we're here, it's a fire extinguisher. Awesome. There we go. Now I can get the briefcase. Awesome. It seems to be closed. Maybe if you examine it closely. Push the button? Oh, I remember. That's how you open it. Okay, cool. TG-01 was inside the briefcase. There was also an explanation for the document. I remember what this thing is for. Okay, yeah. I gotta bring this whole... I gotta bring... Okay, this little plate right here. Remember that 3D printer I just we just saw earlier? Yeah, I gotta put that thing there, and then the little emblem that we saw, I have to put that thing on it, and it copies the emblem. I can use that emblem to put it somewhere else. Die. Okay, you fell over. See? <laughs> Don't even shoot them when they fall. Just keep running over. Bitch! Ooh, you missed. You suck. Now, I remember... The way I remember is this little this little plate that I have. This thing right here, the silver thing, the TG-01, could, shouldn't be detected as metal. 
Yeah, see, it's not. Okay, I remember. It was just the lighter that was burning up. They're banging on the windows now. Ew. I guess they want me. I don't know. Now I need to get this little emblem that's in here so I can copy it. The cool part is that when it copies it and it scans it and stuff like that, it'll make a duplicated version. And since that little plate on the right side you're looking at now can't be detected by metal, I can use that to place it wherever I need to place it to get through. I don't know. I forgot where I have to place it to get to the next level or the next portion of the map, but uh, I'll find it out soon. I don't think I'll be needing Yeah, You won't be needing that. Okay. Oh, the glass broke. What the hell am I supposed to do? Dude, I heard the glass broke. <gasps> They're coming this way. What do I do? I have no bo I have no guns. You've got to be kidding me. Dude. Okay. These zombies look kind of slow, so maybe I can lead them out here, juke them out, and then run in here. Because I don't have any guns. I forgot about this part. Damn it. It's just one zombie? Come on. Oh, don't. Don't run after me. Get away from me. I know you're hungry, but jeez. Get away from me. He wants me. I know there's more in here. Oh, bro. Oh, bro. Oh, sh- Oh, I paused the game. I paused the game by accident. Yes, I want my guns. Yes, I want my guns. I want these hoes back. Now, the only thing is that I don't know where to put that emblem at to get to the next part. Like, I know a plate goes right here into this wall, and I don't think it goes there. Let's leave these zombies. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that zombie's right next to me. Oh, I used it. It fits. Open the door now. Oh, fuck. That zombie was so close to me, I couldn't even open the door before he grabbed me. Okay, awesome, awesome. Zombies. They don't even notice me. Like senpai. Oh, he's coming. Weave game. Wait, can I go through these doors? He's guarding the doors. Uh, this way. Screw you. Weave game. Oh, I can go through the doors. Awesome. Oh, wait a minute. I think there's a worm over here. Like a giant worm. This is the giant worm. Oh, doggies? The fu- Why are dogs over here? Okay, good. This door's open. I just ran in here so they won't hurt me. What's in here? Oh, a room. What's here? Um, a card reader, silver color. Let me find actually a typewriter so I can save because I don't want to end the Let's Play right here without saving. I gotta save first. Hey, Zambies. Let's kill these guys. I'll use my good guns. Oh, there's more zombies coming this way. You know what? Let's just kill them all. Screw it. I got guns. I hear Zambies. Is this a spa? This is a spa. Oh, Zambi. Don't auto lock on. Jeez. Ew, Zambi. Uh, yeah, you can stand there naked while I go down here. What's the valve doing here? Do I shut the valve? I don't know what I'm doing, really. I'm just doing stuff. That's so. That shows the whole left side. Okay, cool. Awesome. Oh, shit! That's all he's alive! The fuck? Get off me. I'm hurt. Oh, perfect. I can use this. Free up a slide. And there's a green herb down here. I could take that, but I'll leave that there. So if I really do need it, I can just come down back here. It's a strategy, man. What's in this room right here, actually? Let's check it out. The knob is missing. Really? You take off knobs? That's stupid. Don't know what this is all about. This is the bow gun. Awesome. It takes up one slot. Cool. It doesn't take up two. All right. Oh, a cutscene. What is this? Oh, this is the monster I was talking about. I remember. Ew. I forgot what it was. What is it? Ew. What is that? Oh, a guy. Okay, never mind then. Help, help, help. I can't get the door open. I can't get the... Whoa. Bro. Ew. You can't do that. That's ugly. That's disgusting. There appears to be no one around. A red picture is hanging in the back. What is that? I can't see the number from here. What number? I don't see anything. I guess that painting has a number on it, which means I'm gonna to have to go inside there. And that monster that just killed the guy. Okay, never mind. Biohazard contamination what the hell? detected. Level three. Emergency Biohazard contamination. Oh, the doors are closing. Evacuate. Run down there. Come on. Come on. Come on. I remember. She'll slide under. Yep. Got it. Awesome. Made it. <gasps> that was close. Now that monster that just killed that guy, I'm gonna to have to go back in there and see those numbers. Those numbers probably lead to something that I need, like, to open a door. It looks like I pretty much investigated everything in here. I only came in here for the bow and arrow that I needed. Oh, doggies. Nope, I forgot about you guys. Don't touch me. Hey, there's bow and arrow rounds over there. <gasps> it's locked. Damn it. If I freaking... They're gonna hit me. Oh, they still missed? They suck. Oh my god, they're bad. They missed me? Okay. <laughs> Go back out here. Screw this. Uh, I know there's zombies out here. I know, I know. 
Get away from me. Don't nobody wants you. Oh shoot. I can weave them. Weave. Weave. Go up the stairs. See, they suck. Oh my god, they're slow. <laughs> yeah, you can speed run through this game real easy, dude. You have plenty of ammo to actually Oh wait. Doggies. Fuck! Oh, that's the first time they actually hit me. Don't touch me. Hey, what's over there? It's sparkling. Oh shoot, the animation saved me. What is this? This is a Oh, I can use this to open up that secret airway where the guillotine is at. I need a typewriter, man. Like, I just need to save my game. I mean, I would go all the way back to where I started or kind of like that and then save, but I kind of want to progress and then save so I have somewhere I can leave off. So in case you do, you guys do want a second part to this, I can continue off of that spot so you guys won't get confused. Oh, that guy missed. Not guy, dog. Oh, you missed too. You suck. I doubt they can come up the stairs. Can they? I doubt they can. They're retarded. See, I'm telling you, dude. <gasps> Wait, he can't. Wow. As soon as I opened the door, he walked up the stairs. That's gay. I didn't think they could. Wow, I forgot. What's in here? Oh, a mansion. Is there a typewriter here? Come on. There's no typewriter here. In Resident Evil 2, when you go into the mansion, you see a typewriter. You can just save your data automatically. Okay, I'll take that. Whatever. Now, let's go up these stairs. I'm not going to stop this let's play until I find a freaking typewriter. Like, if you actually, if you guys are actually this far in the video, go ahead and uh, type in tacos down below or something. I don't know. Just type your comment and say tacos if you're at this point. Because I think I lost all you guys. You know, I'm pretty sure, like, this video will get some views, but I'm pretty sure, like, a quarter's way through, you guys will just stop watching. But I'm just doing a let's play just because I just felt like it. I mean, no reason, actually. Except I have- Oh, a typewriter! I needed this! Looks like the video's gonna end, actually. I just gotta save right here. Yeah, I'm actually gonna end the video. I'm not gonna sit here and just talk while I save, so yeah. Um, there's nothing really else I gotta say. Uh, Merry Christmas, guys. Uh, Christmas in two days. Um, I guess I'll put some stuff in here while I talk. Yeah, Christmas is in two days. Then New Year's is coming up. Uh, I'm actually going to consider um, doing more Five Nights at Freddy's videos, like I said before in the past. I've heard some people say how the trailer is going to come out on December 25th, and I will be doing like the trailer breakdown of it, like I did for Five Nights at Freddy's 2, because apparently people liked it when I break down the trailer and you know do information on that. So, you know, Five Nights at Freddy's coming up. Call of Duty Funny Moments, Gary's Mod videos coming up, so yeah. Just give it time, man. Just give it time. Right now, enjoying my Christmas break. Uh, I know things are really slow on my channel, and like I said, we just won the Clan Wars, and Clan Wars went on for like five days in a row. That's been taking up all my time. Like, I stood up for like hours playing Clan Wars so I can like get some wins for my team, and we did win. We're the Brony Elites, and we got a win, so we just showed up the other guys. They're mad at me. Like, one guy sent me a message and said, screw you, and stuff like that, so he's pretty mad, so... Yeah, guys, congratulations to me won the Clan Wars. Uh, the award for it is actually getting some armor pieces for the Centurion armor, which is stuff that not really many people will have in Call of Duty, because if you want to get it, your clan has to win the Clan Wars. And since we won two Clan Wars in Platinum Division, then we'll be getting another piece, and then we'll, be, we'll look even cooler in the game and stuff like that. People will be like, oh my god, you got that cool helmet? That's awesome, dude. You must be one of those cool guys. And then they'll see on my YouTube, they'll be like, oh, you have a YouTube channel? That's awesome. And then, you know, we make good friends, and they check out my channel. You know, it's just, it's just, that's how you get out there, man, you know. <laughs> We win the clan wars and look awesome. But yeah, I'm going to end it right there. I just saved my game. Uh, I don't know what to do here. I think... Oh, I remember. You get these dual pistols and you got to put them in here. That's awesome. Yeah, I remember. And there's some stuff back there. Okay. Oh, I pushed this thing. What's here? What's down here? Oh, this is the ID card I need to get into that secret room with the monster. Oh, wow. Okay. I think that's the ID card I have to use. So when I get into that room, I got to fight that monster. Oh, crap, dude. Okay, yeah, I'm going to end this right here. Um, I hope you liked the video. Like I said, if you got to this point, go down below in the comments and type in tacos along with your comment you got to say. Uh, like I said, haven't uploaded videos in a while. Been busy with Clan Wars. Uh, Merry Christmas. I actually got a special video coming for you guys, so yeah, just stay tuned for that. If you guys really want me to continue with the part two with this, I can. Uh, I'll do it for you guys. I mean, it's not that hard. All I gotta do is just play the game and talk. Like, it's really easy. I feel like I have to put a little bit more effort than just playing a game, you know. Uh, but yeah, guys, um, hope you liked the video. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and uh, peace out.